What's going on? Steph back with another video. Man, food on my face. Anyway, yeah. Back with another video, man. Today, man, I want to talk about, you know, um, you know, the interactions, you know, when you're dealing with women because, um, you know, especially to uh, my job and, you know, conversations I had, you know, you know, in the real world, you, let's just put it like that, you know, guys like tend to focus on the women who don't want nothing to do with them. And, uh, you know, I always like to go, go on, you know, the Ron Wills method I've actually learned two years ago which is you know just say hi to to the female you know say hi to a couple and just don't even expect like a result or anything like that just say hi and you know i'm gonna say maybe two out of four maybe one out of three may just say hey how you doing or may just spark a conversation with you right but um you know the thing is is, is so weird is that you know guys just tend to focus on the ones who who they who who they just don't like them and it's just like well yeah I, i'm gonna say it like this us humans you know when we say hi to people you know normally like even what my father told me um back in his time you know it's always hi how you doing and it's always a high back and just keep on going but nowadays uh you know some you know I'm going to say it like this, 85% of women, you know, they just maybe just stuck up or maybe just don't want to say nothing to you. And then you just got to just say it like this, okay, no problem. If you just, you just say hi and they don't say nothing, you just keep on moving. And, um, you know, a lot of guys tend to focus on that one instead of just being like, you know what, whatever. And then the ones who do say hi, you know, you just, hey, how you doing? You know, what's going on with you? Like, you know, just stuff like that. Or like in particular, at my job, what you working on today? You know, and then, you know, she starts talking about it. Now, if she wants to engage more with it, meanwhile, she knows she only has an hour to work out, but she just wants to engage with you. Hey, I mean, that's on you. You can just either, hey, continue work out. We can talk later or you can just talk work out with her or yeah, like i just say work out with her but um you know just the, the guys be like oh she, she must got a stuck up attitude and it's just like well maybe or maybe she just got a dude back at home she just want to be faithful to that guy or maybe um i was actually thinking about this in the car ride maybe she's just dealing with a dude but she, she cannot get the relationship out of him because he just rearranging her organs but he, he's just he just like hey look i just want to have fun with you well you know whatever's going through her mind or it could be you know she just had a rough day in classes or you know just a rough day at work she just don't want to be bothered with and you just got to understand and keep him moving and keep him going right and even um you know a lot of guys be out here you know oh man you know social media platforms like tinder and bumble man you know, I, I I be getting them sometimes, but sometimes they don't turn out to be right. But I'm like, why are we focusing on the social media apps instead of like the, um, you know, face to face interaction with the female, right? You know, like I know guys who do have those interactions with the women, but it's not like you know the high eights, nines, like the baddies and all that stuff. But you know. But my thing is, is just like, you know, you're not going to win them all, but, you know, you're going to win with some. And and, and guys got to understand this, too. Like, let's say you're someone who goes to the gym. You know, I always like to use a gym and you see the same woman for about six months to a year because, you know, most people going to be at the gym. I wouldn't say consistently, consistently working out but you're gonna mostly see them at the gym 
just doing blase blah whatever because nowadays you know people are just on their phones more than working out i'm, I'm not gonna say nothing there that's just <laughs> it is what it is what it is but um you know you're gonna see them and then maybe in the first couple times like you know to a woman who's either by herself with a friend she's gonna she's not really gonna like want to interact with a dude because of how today's world is you know a lot of men out here are creeps right a lot of men out here are, are are weirdos like even um i'm gonna break down this story like real quick you know two days ago right three days yeah two days ago no three days ago some dude was just acting completely weird to the woman and completely scared them away and then now one of the girl's father's is a former cop and is looking for the guy because like you know the dude was just being creepy and weird he didn't really do nothing it's just he just didn't have any good social skills and now he's got to pay the ultimate price because dad is really wanting to find his guy but it just shows man you know you, you gotta interact with the women in the real world you know what i'm saying not just the fives and sixes and sevens i'm talking about them high eights you know what I'm saying? But it's the engagement that's more important, right? You got to you gotta understand of like how she feels towards you because, you know, um, I made a video on this about good posture and shout out to Ron Wills about it. Even though, I, even though I've developed good posture in the past three, mm, yeah, three to four, years like you know i really just understand walking with your back straight but ron wills really put uh um an emphasis on this is you know your good posture how you walk how's your body built you know that's why we uh, always talk about body game body game is very important you know that let's go back that chick who sees you consistently at the gym she's gonna give you that i choose this thing maybe later on you know because a lot of guys man you know uh one two three oh she got attitude she she her 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 her, her, her attitude stink it's like well you don't know what she's going through in life and this is why i say when you carry yourself and you're not focused on her she may just reel back to you and then maybe who knows you may have a conversation with her you know, maybe a month later, maybe two months later, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, you know, the woman has a lot going in her life. Like how us men have a lot going in our lives, you know, women do too. Yeah, women do mess around with, um, I don't want to say multiple guys, but yeah, multiple guys. But it's just, it, it all depends on you. You know, it all depends on you. And, and no, I'm sorry, it depends on your conversation. No, the way you carry yourself and just what she's going through you know a lot of guys got to take into that right i'm gonna give you a prime example of that because um you know i'm not trying to be braggadocious but i'm a, I'm a regular dude at the gym who works there right i'm gonna say or i'm, I'm gonna be honest i'm not gonna lie I, i'm a work i'm a janitor working at the gym and um I remember this girl, like I'd say like a year and a half ago, but I don't remember myself talking to her. And then I'd say two months ago, cause I know she got school or she probably switched gyms or anything like that. You know, I seen her and like at first, at first I didn't recognize, I couldn't put like, you know, the name together and stuff. And then she was just like, oh, hey, how you doing? You know, blah, blah, blah. We were just having a quick, brief conversation i was really just trying to do the rest of my job and, and post more on instagram and stuff like that because i got a lot of um magazine pages i have to post on my instagram but we were just having a quick conversation but um within those two months as well we just engage we just engage more and more and more and i was just like wait I don't know what I did for her to even like, you know, always making the eye contact and stuff like that. And then um, recently, even Monday, she was like, I was like, um, you know, what are you doing for spring break or whatever, you know? And she also too asked me how my life was. And I told her uh, a little bit of the truth. I didn't want to seem vulnerable or anything. 
but I told her the truth about and then she was just we were just like sitting there having like a little bit of like a 10 to 20 minute conversation and I didn't want to interrupt her workout but she was like no I, I, lo I love talking she's like no I love talking to you I was like oh okay and then right then and there we I just started to understand and realize like wow this this is uh, pretty crazy. I don't know. Maybe it was just the body game. Maybe I was just taking care of myself. Me. And there was a time, too, where I was telling you guys, um, you know, what was going on with my pops. And I didn't want to be bothered with anything. And in the video I said before, she was eyeing my me and this one dude. We were talking. And he noticed it. I didn't care about it. He noticed it. I knew too, but I didn't care about it because I didn't want to be bothered. So what I'm trying to tell dudes is this, man. It's like, you know, with with women, man, don't strike yourself out so quickly because sometimes she may not. Let me see. Myself, she may not like you right then and there or, you know, she may not be feeling you. But as you carry yourself in a well manner you know she may just like come back to you you know what i'm saying no means i'm gonna honestly say this is the first time i've ever said this on a video no means not right now but it doesn't mean like no means forever you can you can close that door you have the option to close that door but if this girl banging and like like the woman i'm just talking about this girl's banging bro she she may get you she 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 may want you later on in life and that's that's okay you don't you don't care about what she's done in her past you just got to understand of okay i can get her but i can also get her and i can also get her and that's what a lot of men tend to do you know strike themselves out or just say oh she got an attitude you just don't know right because not every woman is going to hook up with the the model type dude you know physically like you know amazing body real handsome in the face no homo pause um you know she's not going to do that you know a lot of guys out here are regular right R like you know regular and you know they they may not you know give you that opportunity right now but it's just don't strike yourself out that's why i say in the social media world, you know, you you as a dude, you kind of lose it with the female because the difference with, you know, these tenders and versus the real world is like, you know, it's all about energy. You know, she when a woman is liking you, she's locked into your eyes like, you know, she really likes you. She's getting closer to you. You know what I'm saying? It's not you texting. She wants to see you. She may want to work out with you. She may want to hang with you, you know, out, you know, outside of, you know, you doing your job or you someone like me who's, who's, who's building stuff on his own and stuff, you know, you can't do that with, you know, a couple pictures and, long texts on social media maybe it may work because maybe you're just the right angle for you works or for her but it's just you tend to lose it that way because when you two are talking for a couple days and then it's like okay time to link up and she just like eh, it's not what i thought you know you you get that right there in the real world you know you may get it you know on the first day you meet her or it may take you a couple months you know what i'm saying it may take you a couple months see this is experience what you got to go through see you know guys got to understand the concept shout out to tk kirkland um a bad chick breathing on him that's very important gotta have that understanding of a, a, a bad chick breathing on him because then when you when you get that concept, you don't really be tripping on most women who be rejecting you. Right? You understand what I'm saying? Like you don't get that. But it's just it takes a lot of work. And this is coming from someone who's a skinny, skinny, hunched over halo kid. You know, you gotta put the work in. That's why I always tell guys, man, take your time away from some women. You know, work out, 
body game, enjoy life with the fellas. You know what I'm saying? Those things are more important than just uh, women with stuck up attitudes. You know what I'm saying? Like you, you can be a guy who doesn't get no women, but you got your purpose. I think a lot of men really tend to forget that because you know there it was like a certain era in this little uh, red pill space of oh purpose, 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 and it just flies out because a lot of men not understanding that um pers purpose um means everything um, shout out to ron wilts on being a sovereign man you know sovereign men man to, to women is like at the bottom because he's got to eat place to live you know um for a lot of you men out there who want to have children you have to build something so you can pass it to your children not on women you know that's the, the most main important and shout out to ron wilson on that sovereignty is way more important now if women want to build with you for for your children not like what andrew wiggins is possibly going through <laughs> you know that's yeah then then you bring her aboard but you know you as a man have to understand that your life is more important got to understand those concepts that's the end of this video, man. I'm going to do a little bit of this workout. Probably going to do some legs and abs today. And, uh, maybe, who knows, maybe back. Maybe pull-ups. I love doing pull-ups. But that's why I really want to say, man, because, and this is the last thing I'll say, is fellas, don't strike yourselves out, man. It's not cool. I'm out.